Nature is wisdom. I once locked a bear, a lion, and an elephant in a room to learn this wisdom. It was carnage. But you can learn so much at the training camp. You face eight missions in the sewer. Apply the knowledge, turn those worms into small, skinny sleeping bags. When I first encountered these amazingly intelligent and highly evolved worms, my initial thoughts were, what's the best way to kill them? Any wildlife documentary maker worth his salt should be able to take down any endangered species with nothing more than a biro, an elastic band, and a brief... Now, you can experience hardcore, full-on, worm-to-worm -worm combat at grassroots level. But this isn't just about fighting. It's about observing nature, collecting wildlife data, cross-referencing. Actually, it's about fighting. Know your environment. Familiarize your ocular pods with every inch of the terrain. Except that little bit there, that's nothing. He was one day away from retirement. Sad for him, but visually pleasing. Next target, please. Remember, we're here only to observe and document worm activity and blow some up. Choose the grenade. Wildlife filmmaker can't get attached to the animals he records. So let's blow another one up to remain impartial. Him. Wait, 
shots to hold the viewer's attention. Try an airstrike on that one there. First wildlife campaign completed. Okay, you killed all the wildlife, but we did get some great shots, and that's what's important. Winners! I have in my hand a piece of paper. On it, in crayon, is written, It's war. How cool is that? Yes, it's time for the second training session. Not only will you learn how to kill worms with advanced movement and weaponry such as mines, you'll also learn how to turn hazards to your advantage. We didn't get this sort of training in the Woodland Stoke Brigade Scouts, although we did kill... Move it! Huh. Okay, look at that oil drum. Is it just landscape? In its current state, yes. If you blow it up, no. Then it becomes Mount Killiwum Jar, spewing forth molten napalm in more directions than you can shake. The 
last of the hostiles and last of his family tree if all goes well. You deserve a medal for your work here today, but you're not getting one. 